Okay, my name is Minu. I'm 26. I'm from Burma. Okay, I came to Thailand like 2000, 2008. Okay. I knew the headmaster. They contacted me come to teach at their school. So they first they contact my they contact with my parents and then my parents told me you wanna you wanna be a teacher or something like that. I think oh yes of course I will be. Burmese people run out from the country because there are wars and eco economic problems. Their children, nothing to do. They just run around, uh, no education, uh, no place. So when I see this problem, uh, so I decide to start morning glory. The uh, conflict is going on in Burma because of uh, grievances of ethnic people. Uh, civil war started uh, soon after independence with different ethnic groups. So there are many ethnic conflict going on in the ethnic area, ethnic nationalities. So they cannot go back because of the forced border, uh, forced relocation, forced border, and uh, and fighting going on in, in in the territory. So they become refugees. There are ten refugee camps. Uh, the nearest to Mesot is uh, Mela, uh, Om Pian and Novo. Uh, and formerly there were the uh, refugees were about 150,000, but now it's less than that. You know, life is really different in it refugee camp. The houses are really made out of bamboo and they are really crowded with because there are a lot of populations. It's more than like a, a, a 20s uh, to, uh, 20 to 30,000 people in a small area. You know, the, your houses are crowded. It's thousands of houses together. They, when the military come and attack, they will burn, uh, they will shoot and kill uh, on site, everyone. And then they will destroy the village, they will toss to ashes all the, the village. This is the big problem that we have been uh, struggling we have to uh, suffer for many years. We live here, we cannot do anymore, we cannot go outside. If we go outside, the police didn't let us go to another place. We don't have a Thai citizen car, we don't have permissions to stay in China, only refugee camp. People are not, not animals, not like Animals. Even animals, you put them in the cave, they try to escape, or try to run away. So people, when you put them in the cave, when they can't do anything, can't go anywhere, they have a problem, there will be explosion or something, like undesirable things that can happen. So we don't want that to happen, we want mutual love, mutual understanding, mutual respect, and helping one another. All people. Please help our our Bahama country and stay in the our people. They want to peace. They want to see peace, and then they don't want to fighting with our Bahama government. Therefore, just now this situation is very so bad. So we have to. Pray for the situation in Burma for changes that we really it, this peace and reconciliation will come to Burma and then we can live in peace and unity. We try the best we can to live and help one another, respect one another. So I always use the word with mutual love, mutual understanding, mutual respect and mutual helping one another. Only only in this way we can live together and we can make life more uh, meaningful for living.
Currently, uh, there's uh, in last year, uh, 2012, there's a quantum change from uh, dictatorship to democracy. And the political prisoners were released and uh, so many changes. Uh, the, the world is starting to give attention and instead of uh, pariah nation for uh, nearly 50 years, uh, it's, uh, it's changing. And then when I'm cave first week, I'm crying every day. I'm crying every day because this is my first time away from the hall. And then I cry, I'm going back to outside. And then one of the students come and hugging me. Teacher, don't go back home. So I sound falling like, oh, really? Yeah, I'm not going back to start that. Learn it in Burma, we can we can choose be yourself just like that. Oh, one day we can be something or doctor or engineer or something like that. Here, they they don't know, they don't they don't know how to choose the, their future. And I just want to help the student. Not I I know my teaching is not good enough for that. Just want to learn from me just how to be like good person or something like that. The school is changed every year. Student increase, and now we have 480 students. They need some class, like chair, and then they need more space, and then play like playground or something like that. They need more playground and more classroom. Yeah, I want to be. Uh, they have a good future, and then they can. Then good education for them. Okay, I love the kids very much. Without his, his life, his, it is a hellish and dangerous, dangerous place for living. 
So let us come together, hold our hands, and let us make the world a better and a meaningful place for living.